Hi there, it's Gabe with API Nation. Today I'm gonna to show you how to connect KV Core to your smartphone, your iPhone, your Android phone. It's gonna sync all your contacts from KV Core into the phone so you always know who's calling or texting. If you're out on the road, you can immediately get in contact with your clients. You don't have to call back to the office to get that number. You don't have to open up a separate app. Just start typing their name and then start texting away. Really easy, let me show you how. I'm gonna open up KV Core. Here we go. And I'm just going to head over to the marketplace. The marketplace in KV Core is where all the little secrets, the shortcuts are. API Nation, we've built quite a few of these. And you can just go over to the API Nation tile to take a look. Here we are. I'm going to click Learn More and then Add to KV Core. And that's going to take me out to API Nation where all these integrations live. So you can see we have integrations for MailChimp. You can sync all your contacts to a Google Sheet, have Mojo Dialer sync contacts into KV Core. We're gonna sync it to Google Contacts because that's what the phone uses to update my phone book. So I click Google Contacts, and now all I have to do is sign into KV Core, hit Connect to KV Core. So that's step one. Step two, also real easy, I'm just gonna to connect to Google account. It's gonna serve up a Google account if you've connected one to API Nation in the past, or you can just click connect Google account and pick out the Google account of your choice. I'm going to click my professional account here. That way all the leads from KV Core can get synced to the phone and any changes or new leads I add to my phone will automatically get synced into KV Core. So this is it. We've connected KV Core. We've connected Google contacts. The last thing to check is just a few questions here. The first thing is, do I want this to be a two way sync? So anybody I add to KV Core is going to my phone. Anybody add to my phone is getting added to KV Core, or do I just want to do it one way? I'd suggest two ways so that your phone and KV Core are in lockstep. Next, it's going to ask if I want to sync all my contacts on first run, or if I only want to do any new contacts. Most likely, you want everybody in your phone, so I would just leave this box checked. And then, if you want to filter by type, for example, if I only want to put agents in there, I can do that. Or if I only want to put buyers and sellers in there, I can do that also. I'm gonna go ahead and put everybody in there. That way I get buyers, sellers, renters, vendors, everybody. You can also filter by source if you'd like. So if you only wanna send people over from Facebook leads or send people who came from that open house, you could do that as well. As far as Google Contacts go, same question. Do you want everybody in Google Contacts sent into KV Core or do you just want anybody you start adding now? I'm gonna leave this box checked again. I want. Uh, these people added to KV Core. Second thing, really important, the contacts who get synced into Google Contacts will be tagged with something. Right now, by default, they're tagged with KV Core people. That way, anybody who gets added to Google Contacts automatically gets that tag and you know who they are. It also helps because if you tag them with KV Core people as they come in, this integration will know to only sync people back into KV Core who have that KV Core people tag. It can really help you keep your database nice and clean. This way, if you add a lead on your phone, you can go ahead and tag it as KV Core people and it goes right into your database. If you add a friend on your phone, don't tag them. They won't end up in your database. Easy peasy. Last step, if we happen to find a match, do we want to leave Google Contacts the way it is and then only add information from KV Core if fields in Google Contacts are blank? Or do we wanna overwrite all the fields in Google Contacts? So if you're starting with a fresh Google Contacts, a fresh Google account, or a Google account with contacts that are a little bit out of hand, maybe you wanna overwrite all that information. If it's pretty well under control, if it's pretty accurate, don't overwrite it, leave it here. That's it, I'm gonna go ahead and hit start. You'll see I now have two workflows in here, Google Contacts into KV Core and KV Core into Google Contacts. If for whatever reason I decide I actually want it to be a one-way sync or I want to turn it off, I can just hop in here and turn off whatever direction I want. But I'm gonna just go ahead and leave it running. That way, all my contacts are always updated in Google Contacts. Let's, let's take a look at what those look like as they come over. So I popped open my Google Contacts. Here's that tag, KV Core people. There's all my KV Core people starting to show up in Google Contacts. Now, wherever I'm at, if I'm on the road, if I don't want to open a separate app, I know all my contacts are backed up to my phone. All that information is with me. I can text, I can email, 
without having to go copy and paste this contact information. Saves me a ton of time, super convenient. Hey, if you found this was helpful, go ahead and like the video and subscribe to the API Nation channel. We release a lot of videos about how to save time as a real estate agent so you can go make more deals. If you have any questions, ideas, give us a phone call, shoot us an email. We're API Nation, connecting the world's applications. We love doing this stuff.